Hello and welcome to another Cycletech review unboxing. Today we have some Pirelli P0 Race TT tyres. These tyres are for time trialling or triathlons. The kind of race where you can keep a view on the road ahead and you just want to go as fast as possible. So let's have a look at the box and what's inside. Um, there on the back here it says time trial performance and endurance. It uses Smart Evo compound. That's their most advanced road specific formulation for p0 race only it's got a light nylon uh, casing and the bead technology what's the bead technology um basically it's just the, the bead that runs through here and holds your tire in place these are for tubes not tubeless but tube tires so inner tubes for which you're going to be taking a look at these p0 smart tubes um have a look at those in a sec let's have a look at what's inside the p0 Race TT. There's a quick look. You've got some instructions on there on how to mount your tyre. Always useful if you're not sure how to do it. I like the boxing. Nice little bit of packaging there. Folds up neatly. Let's get rid of that. And here's the tyre. Comes with some handy little, uh, rather than your normal rubber band that you get, you get a nice little, uh, there you go. You can now wear your tyre brand with pride. Look at that. Okay, let's have a look at the tyre. Okay. It's quite a supple, thin casing there. It's not as thin as, say, a Pro Course or anything like that, but it certainly does feel lightweight. I'll do a... Um, we've done a preview, and I'll put some weights on it, and I'll put it in a link below so you can see. Um, it's got quite a light tread on it and it does feel thin this is not a heavy you're not going to be commuting to work on this let's put it that way guys this is a pure race tire so that's the p0 race tt nice red brand in there so you know what you're on and so do your competitors actually they'll be watching out for you and if you're going to be saving weight and riding on a super lightweight tire then you're going to want a super light inner tube that's in these days of tubeless people are still running in the tube. So let's have a look at what we've got in here. This is um, rather than the normal butyl. This is made from a um, thermoplastic. And it's very, it is very light. Um, it's got a little, oh, it's very yellow as well. I think you can see that quite clearly. Um, got some warnings here. Let's have a look. Temperature warnings that it could burst. Let's have a look. A little bit of just telling you how to uh, how to mount it. All the usual. Make sure your tire is clear before you put anything in. But I mean that is just ridiculously light. I mean compared to your normal um, butyl inner tube, this this doesn't feel like anything I felt before. Um, long valve, long black valve. Um, and you can clearly see where it goes in there. Made in Austria. Mm, unusual. For use of rim brakes and disc brakes. Only a repair with a TPU. That's thermoplastic. I'm not sure what TPU stands for. But specific repair kit. So you can repair them. But you need to use a specific um, repair kit. This is very lightweight, guys. I'll be interested to see how this performs out on the road. Sorry about the clattering sounds in the background. Um, but we're trying these out. Uh, we'll put them on the time trial bike. We'll put a review once we've done it. There's a preview up on Cycle Tech Review at the moment. But um, keep an eye out for the actual review once you've had a chance to use the P0 Race TT and the Pirelli P0 Smart Tube. Thanks very much for looking. Bye.